All right, hi everyone. So the last search trick that I want to share with you is the process for searching within journals at Jenks. This can also be another really quick and powerful way to help narrow down your search a little bit. So I mentioned in the searching the database video that it's always a good idea to start paying attention to the types of journals or the names of journals that are appearing uh, over and over again in your search. Oftentimes when we conduct research, we see a collection of journals that seem to be publishing information about our topic. So take note of those. And when you do find the name of a journal, uh, you can actually come here to our library homepage, go over to the journals tab, and use this search journal finder feature to search uh, by name of the journal that you're looking for and then search within it. If you are doing, if you're wondering, um, well, I, I really want to do that. That sounds like a good idea, but I don't know any journals about uh, my particular topic. You can actually use this second link down here where it says use browsing. Browsing is a browsable uh, journal database essentially uh, that pulls from all of our major databases and um, any other subscriptions, online subscriptions that we might have. Um, so if you're not sure what journals to look for or which ones yet, you can come over here and you can browse by subject area. So communication and fine arts live under the social science and behavioral science subject area. So you can come in there and then click on communications and journalism and get a further subject breakdown of major communication journals with that we have available. Um, so you can come over here and maybe pick one. Uh, let's go down to this one about rhetoric, composition, and speech, since that's the example that we're working with. And a really good one for this, for this particular student was rhetoric and public affairs. So we could come in here and see uh, the current volume that's available and then drill into other ones as well. So browsing can be a way for you to actually discover what journals um, might be out there on your particular topic. But to search within it, we are actually going to go back to the home page and now I'm going to click on that search journal finder. So I'm going to type in the name of the journal I'm looking for, Rhetoric and Public Affairs, and click search. And what I'm looking for is does Jenks have access to this? And yes, it does in two different options here. So we could search either CMMC or we could search JSTOR. I'm going to pick CMMC since that's a database we are familiar with. If you've watched the other video I created for you. So when we land on the journal landing page within our CMMC database, we can click on this link that says search within this publication. And then this allows us uh, uh, notice on our search box at the top here it has a little JN for journal so we're searching within this particular journal and then we can throw in some keywords so let's keep with our keywords that we were working with before we're going to do rhetoric again on my first line and then we also want to do division go ahead and click search. So it's the same search box that we were seeing before, same search construction as when we were doing the database search, but we're searching uh, in a little bit different way, searching within a journal here. So we get a list of five results, uh, but the idea behind searching within a journal is that you're scoping your search a little bit to be a little bit narrower and hopefully, hopefully a little bit uh, more specific to what it is that we are looking for. So pay attention to those journals that you're seeing a lot. Try to use the search within this feature and you can use some basic keywords to see if there's other potential articles that might be out there. Thanks.